well summer is still going strong. It's never too soon to begin preparations for flu season. In today's morning rounds, KCY 12's Dave Alley takes a look at immunizations like the flu shot and the role vaccines serve in protecting people of all ages. It's a rite of passage for Americans, an assortment of shots throughout childhood. So the whole principle of immunization is to give you a piece of a germ or an entire germ that's inactivated and can no longer infect, and then to have your immune system build up memory. That memory is important when a potentially dangerous germ later enters the body. So the next time it sees that, which could be an infectious process as opposed to an immunization, the memory is built in and the immune system can give it its full response and ward off the infection. Vaccine preventable diseases include measles, hepatitis, pertussis, polio, and much more. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, many of these diseases are still common in the United States. Many are highly contagious and many are serious even for healthy people. However, many are fearful immunizations may pose a risk. Some believe they may play a role in autism. The data is extremely weak on that, and I think most doctors would tell you they strongly believe immunizing your children fully, beginning from day one of life, is the appropriate thing to do. The CDC says all vaccines in the U.S. require extensive safety testing before they're licensed by the Food and Drug Administration, and the two organizations work with healthcare professionals to monitor the safety of vaccines. A well-known vaccine administered to people of all ages is the flu shot. Flu shots are easy to come by. You can get them at your doctor's office. You can get them at clinics. You can often get them at pharmacies. And a yearly flu shot is recommended. No matter where you get them, doctors are recommending flu shots as early as next month. Dave Alley, KCOY 12, Central Coast News.